To connect with the cross, we must be baptized into his death. My brothers, my sisters, my friends, baptism is not a meritorious work. We don't earn one thing when we're baptized into Christ. We, God doesn't owe us salvation. But it is a mystical, sacramental act in which God and man come together. It's God's way for us to make that final and real connection with the cross. In Romans chapter 6 verse 3. Do you not know that as many of us as were baptized into Christ Jesus were baptized into his death? Folks, isn't that what we're trying to connect with is the death of Christ? The cleansing blood of Christ, the suffering of Christ, everything that happened on that cross when we're buried with Christ in baptism... We're connecting into that death. Galatians 3 verse 27. Start with verse 26. He says, For we are all sons of God through faith in Christ Jesus. For as many of you as were baptized into Christ have put on Christ. Or you have clothed yourselves with Christ. See, there's a holy moment in which a person that has heard and understood the gospel... A person that has allowed the gospel to convict them, change their thinking, and they have decided, they've made a commitment. A person who has verbalized that commitment to serve Jesus as Lord. There is a holy moment in which that person is immersed in water and they are united in that moment with the cross of Christ in the mind of God. In Colossians 2 verse 12 it says we were buried with him through baptism and we were raised with him through faith in the working of God. God is working in the moment of baptism. He's cleansing us from sin. He's filling us with the Holy Spirit. He's, he's uniting us with the blood of Christ. He's bringing us into reconciliation with God. He's putting us in his church. He's doing all of those things at one moment. In Romans 6 verse 4. We were therefore buried with him through baptism into death. Notice the with hymns. In order that just as Christ was raised from the dead through the glory of the Father, we too may live a new life. If then we have been united with him, the next verse says, in the likeness of his death, so shall we also be in the likeness of his resurrection. To be connected with the cross, you've got to be baptized in the death of Christ. Who says so? The whole New Testament says so. Hey, I'm Dan Owen, the minister at the Broadway Church of Christ, and if you're listening to this series on connecting to the cross biblically, and if you'd like to study it some more and talk with me, just email me at dan at broadwaycoc.com or call the church building, 270-443-6206. Come visit us on Sunday mornings at 930. Look forward to hearing from you.